Before the video starts, I would like to ask that you guys subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell for notifications, leave a comment down below, and like the video. I would heavily appreciate it. Hope you enjoy. The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. I often wonder what my purpose is. I go from town to town and live out my mundane life. Eat a little here, steal a little there. Not like I can't have a good life. I just choose not to. I was someone else back then. Someone I'm not proud of. Now, here I am. I wish I could take it back. Take back all the things I did. Take back all the wrongs I committed. Take back the lives I took. Take back the people I hurt. But there's no point in dwelling on the past. The future is what will live on. And I must move with it. Someday, I'll pay back what I've done. But until then, here's hoping I'll make it to that day. I'm sorry, Master. I wish I controlled myself better. I hope you'll be proud of me one day. Appreciate the food, Betty, as well as the warm couch. Very much appreciate it. You're way too good to me. Though I still need to talk to Catherine. She could be in danger, and that's the thing. Damn, this is not my job, is it? This is not my job at all. If anything, I should probably just direct her over to the Protector's Guild. Oh, Brian's our next door neighbor. Could probably talk to him about her. Though he does seem a little oblivious. Hard doesn't even know he has a neighbor. Though that just kind of seems like him. I'm being asked for no reason. Gotta stop that. Okay. Well, I just. Is it rude if I don't walk on the path, or if I do? Yeah. This girl's in serious danger, if my theory is correct. Oh, uh, hi. Hey, uh, do you mind if I came inside for a bit? Oh, of course. Come on in. Um, ma'am, Miss Catherine, um... <clears throat> I, uh, I don't mean to worry you whatsoever, and if anything, I implore you to seek protection after I tell you what's, I think's going on with you. Well, what do you mean? You see, after I, well, found you being mugged by that other guy, I, I did a bit of investigating myself. You and did? Yes, yes. I, I found the first guy, the, the one that, that took your ring. And I asked him a couple questions. And from what I found out, he was not always a thug, but instead he was a banker. Uh oh. Yes, and the reason I'm bringing this up is because, well, why would a banker do anything a thug would do, right? It just doesn't make sense. Yeah, it doesn't at all. Yeah. And so I, well, did a bit more investigating. And, well, I can't really say full proof. I think that he might be, that might have been mind controlled. Mind controlled? Yes, it's a, it's a little rare, but 
It's a magic that does exist. Oh. And uh. I only come to here to warn you because I think someone might be using it on using it to attack you. To attack me? Um. Uh. Well, you were mugged. Uh, yeah, I just uh. Twice, practically. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> and when I did find you, I uh, I did detect some magic in the air. Small, but was still there. Should have followed the trail. Should have followed the stage. Sorry, I'm getting off topic. Point being is that I'm telling you this because you may be in danger. You understand? Yeah, I, I just wow. That's really troubling to hear. It's not every day you're told that you're in danger, you know. Um, again, sorry, just, I cope with humor. Again, just making sure you're okay. Well, I thank you for looking out for me. No problem, just, man. Should I just keep calling you Catherine, or? Uh, if you want, I mean, it's too difficult. I mean, you can call me my nickname. Which is. I go by Cat with my friend. Well, I don't mean to intrude then. It's alright. I think we're friends at this point, since you've, you know, saved me from being mugged. <laughs> I... okay. Cat. <laughs> I don't really know about the whole, uh, thing. Do you happen Targeting to things? have any enemies? People that you may have crossed in the past? Because if so, then... well... I am part of a guild. I just need to make... Can't deal with that. Yeah, um... There is this one person... Um, really? What's their name? Yeah. Troy. Um... They've always, uh, been after me. I'm not entirely sure why. Really? What's their last name? Yeah. I don't really have their last name. I only have their first. Okay, um... Okay, then. Well, where exactly do they live? North of the city, or...? I don't know. They, they, I've usually seen them around here. Alright. Yeah, um... Troy, is it? Yeah. What do they look I, like? I'm not... Well, I mean, it's... I've only, like, seen them occasionally, and it's at night. I don't really get a good look at them. Okay. They mostly just used to leave notes, but I, used to, I just threw them away. I thought they were weird, but... I think you might um, be dealing with a stalker, then. Maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. I mean, they might be after me because of my... me. I mean, after I inherited my, my family's fortune. Um, I'm not sure if, but if that's what he wants or if he wants something else from me. Of course. You know, because... <sighs> well, look at me, am I right? <laughs> yeah. Um... If there's any information you can give me about this man, I will... It will help, because I can't go off of nothing. Yeah, um, I... I do have some information. I, I did hire somebody to go look for this person, but they never really found anything. So I'm not sure if they used, uh, if you wanna... A mythology? Yeah. Lovely paintings you have. Thank you, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> huh. So, yeah, we... this is your office, I'm assuming? Or your study? Yeah. My study and upstairs is my library. Like, more of my books and stuff, and then uh, my it's little reading big area. big room for, for house for one person. Yeah, um, I just wanted to make sure I was comfortable out here. <laughs> Alright, okay. Um, yeah, we don't, again, it's not a ton like I'm like, but, um, I, you know, he, Not you a know. ton, this is quite a bit. They're all pretty much dead ends. The, the detective I, I hired to, like, look for it, just, uh, couldn't find much, but that's all I could find. Did you not read the documents? It, it says he has black hair, mm -hmm. and... Hmm. Well, he told me that there was not much to really go off of with it. So I just trusted that and paid him and moved on. I mean, I'll do what I can. I might have, might get others to help me, but 
Mm. You know, I really appreciate that you're helping me. I mean, it's... I think it's something I kind of have to do. <laughs> well, I mean... And all that. I mean, I mean, you coming over here to, to me really means a lot. I... I've well, been dealing with this by myself for a while, so I guess, you know, I can call... I and mean, you've helped me so much. How often have you been mugged, then? Well, not really the mugging. It's more like I see things following me sometimes, or I'll see notes. Again, I threw the notes away. Those were at the beginning. Because, hmm. again, I didn't think there were much. I wish you help. I wish I had kept uh, all of those notes, because... Oh, yeah, I wish I did, too. Yeah. Tell you, if this, if it gets worse, you should head to the Protectors Guild. I'm not sure if I should because I. I think you should. Well, it, I went to a guild before for this. Yeah, it's you know, Grimshade. Their whole yeah. guild fell apart. It was honestly bad so timing really, from the looks of things. Yeah, I really don't trust that fully. So I'm just, you I mean, know, you trust me, I think, and I'm part of the guild. Yes, because you came to me as I assumed Grimshade because you told me. So I thought you were just. But now I just know you're a really good person. Yeah. Uh, hmm. Again, we should probably get to know each other more. Since, you know, you will always seem to pop up when I'm in danger. <laughs> um, what do you mean by that? I mean, I didn't expect to find you when you uh, came upon me uh, getting mugged. I uh, also didn't think you'd help me with. Kind of an accident. Yeah, but still, I think it was kind of like fate. <laughs> Well, uh, cat, um, <laughs> what exactly are you getting at? Well, um, I could say that it's something cheesy, like a nice pickup line. I think you know what I'm getting at. <laughs> um, I'm, uh, I'm not, I'm not sure. I, I've never really been on a date before. Well, I'd love to take you on one. Okay, uh. I think it could be fun. Sure, I, sure. That's great. Um, if you, if you're available in a few days, you can come on by. I, I, I think I should be. Great. Have fun. Just you and me. Yeah. I, uh, I should probably start investigating these things. Oh yeah, sure. Um, let me walk you out. Yeah. You know, you do live next to a protector guild member, right? Yeah. Second Ryan. in the, second in charge, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. That yeah. Well. He's a good person. I've seen him at many parties before. <laughs> well, cat, cat. Um, I'll be looking into this. All right. I promise, I'll find at least something, okay? The fact that you're putting in any effort at all is just more than I've ever expected anyone to do. Well, so. I guess I have a bit of a... perk. I, I'll, I'll, so much. Of course. If, if there's this. anything going on, by the way, you can find me at the south side of town. Alright. Near again. Betty's, more and, than likely. Uh, and I look forward to seeing you in a couple days. Well, I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye. Oh, I got a date! Ah. <laughs> well, you did it. Getting a date. Only 27 years old, but going on your first actual date. That's just great. That's kind of pathetic, isn't it? Whatever. I'm too busy being trained to ever, ever go on dates, weren't you? Idiot. Why doesn't she go to the Protector's Guild? She lives right next to one. One of the strongest in that guild, anyways. That just doesn't make any sense. Whatever. Whatever. What should I start off from this list? Hmm. Okay, so what is 10 writings from it? Whatever. Hmm. So, 
south side of town. Went to a house, didn't find anything. Hmm. It cannot be that guy, Matt. It can't be Troy. It can't be the other rich bastard that robbed her. There's a trend here. Rich people keep robbing her. Yeah, the guy that robbed her before was rich. No, maybe he was just more suited. That doesn't make any sense. Then why use mind control if you can just buy someone off to, or pay them? I'll get my answers. I'll get my answers. Jazz wants to offer some help. I might as well ask him, but... <sighs> See how that goes, I guess. I'm not sure if he'd really be the best person for this. And again, I don't know who else I could ask. Flurry, I don't think knows anything about... Well, magic. Maybe I should go to the... Guildmasters. <sighs> they wouldn't listen to me anyways. What the fuck am I on about? What's gonna really ask? This is my issue, anyways. She's being targeted. She needs help. I'm just. Do I really need his help after all? Ugh, guess there's nothing I can do about it now. Do about what? Private conversation, but welcome back! With who? The people in my head. Not a joke? <laughs> You're not laughing, so I guess it wasn't. I'm probably not that funny. Mm, well, your sense of humor doesn't seem to be there. What happened to your hands? A lot of things. Would you be able to hold papers without disintegrating them, or...? My gloves on! Okay, well, uh... I, I talked to you a couple days ago about... Well, sorry, I don't know, a couple hours ago? Mm hmm About... This mind control freak, right? Well, I did a bit of investigating, uh... and uh... Say again, man? Sorry. This mind control person. Are they someone like a friend to you? No. I think they're targeting somebody, I know. You said you wanted to help? Well, I have... Papers. Name's Put them on the ground. Name's Troy, apparently. Mm. I gotta touch it with just one index. There we go. <sighs> Name's Troy. And they have black hair, and this is all the information they gave me. Do you know who they're trying to mind control? No, they're not going after them, specifically. It's just... They're trying to hurt them. I think. Though it doesn't really make any sense to me. Oh. They'll use anyone to get to them. Probably someone close. None of these people are close. That's the thing. It's happened twice really? from what I know. There are rich people, but all of them are rich. There must be an end goal to it all. That's the thing. What is the goal at that point? The first mm. person that mugged her was a banker. And they, they have no reason to mug somebody. Are you sure you have the right person? Positive. You're positive Troy's the mind controller. That's what they said. Who? This girl I uh, talked to about this. Oh, uh, listen, I never get into your own personal business, but not to say people can lie to you, but <laughs> I think you know that I've lied to you firsthand. Yeah, and I can see you've probably lied even now. Don't you think it's possible that, I don't know, if I was trying to get to someone and I was trying to hurt people, I'd find someone more powerful. I doubt I would have 
Especially if I was that strong. I don't think I would have muggers try to attack some poor, innocent, rich girl. I'd have someone like you do it. Don't you think it's kind of weird with you there that they use someone so weak? Not after her, are they? Doesn't seem like it. If I wanted to kill someone, I'd just, I don't know, get someone who could do the job. Someone else. Yeah. Are you okay? Never okay, buddy. Ow. What's that for? Uh, kind of getting out of your depressed mood. I can sense it from here. Mm. Yeah, I'm trying not to become a Cecil. That's it's not... what we call depressed people. <clears throat> That's not the point. Uh, I would give you a shake your hand, but I'm not Please, sure if that's uh, the best idea. Don't come near me. Have you talked to Flurry? She left, buddy. I couldn't find her. I She'll be back. I could probably point you in the right direction if you want. I know. I'll mess it up more. If that's what you believe. I've tried. Whatever she wants me to give her, I obviously can't. And whatever you expect out of me, I'm not able to give. It's not because I'm unable. It's because I'm incapable. <clears throat> well, uh... I think the most you can do is just offer her friendship right now. I know you don't know us. <laughs> not really, no. And I, know, I know you don't know what we went through. I found Flurry in a pretty bad situation. I imagine. She seems like yeah. she puts on a mask. A lot like you. But the whole point of it is, she knows that I'm the one person, if she ever dropped down to a point, I'd be there for her. I am her friend. And whenever she needs me, she'll know I'll be right here. And when it comes to the guild, I could care less about if it gets accepted or doesn't. Okay. Well, I wouldn't. I'm not gonna pry into your past. I have some things I want to keep hidden myself. Fine, buddy. We both know you're not long for this. Probably not. No. God, this is some burning fire. That's the point of fire. It's so hot. So one thing I can't destroy, because I can't touch it. Well, I'll probably kill you before then. <laughs> I wish. It was an accident, wasn't it? Everything I do is an accident. <sighs> okay, man. Just... Hop in to her. Check up on her, I guess. She'll be back. I know. I know the next thing we're doing is the show. You know? Well, she don't... She doesn't want me there. Mm -hmm. I'll mess it up. I mean, you don't really know that. <laughs> I mean, the last show we held, I just performed some magic. You know, some... Poof. Forever. I'm not good, especially when people look at me. All I see is their terrifying frowns and their eyes bleed. They're all just looking at you, waiting, laughing. <sighs> okay, man. Look, I, I gotta do some more investigating on my end. I'll probably go visit her again soon, so... Be careful. She may try to hurt someone you care about. Why do you think she's be the one doing that? Something's telling me that, uh... I don't know, I get this weird feeling that... She's never really met I, her before. I don't have to meet people to know where stuff's going on. I mean, dude, you've seen yourself. If you were there, and you were next to her, and she trusts you, why wouldn't the person use you to kill her? Oh. 
right? I'm not stupid. Like that. And I'm just saying to watch out for people you care about, like that Betty person. What is it they, like the magic user, even if it was someone who had an indirect plan, trying to hurt someone you're close to? Because you're getting in their way. It's what I do. They will not get far. Huh. What, after you find a body? Do you even know where she is right now? Who? Either or. Betty doesn't leave her house. Then they'll know that. They'll make it their mission to know. <clears throat> I'll see you later, Jazz. I gotta go visit someone. Yep. Be safe. Same Ninjas nice. about. Hammerheads. They're Hammer gonna heads. try to kill us. I heard about them. Yeah, if they come after you, um, I killed one earlier. Uh, when I met Basil, they seem to be uh, traveling at night, though. So during the day, you should be fine. I don't think they'll get very close to killing me. <laughs> no, there's a reason I wanted you on the team. See you later, Jazz. See ya. Come be concerned for Betty now. Right, he's fucking right, isn't he? Petty. Please be okay. Jesus Christ. Getting close now. Okay, Betty, he's gonna be alright. Just quick checkup, that's all. Betty, come on. Betty! It's it's fine. Are you okay? Oh yes, I took a little nap while my cookies were being baked. Are, Are you all right? Yeah. I'm fine. Are you sure? You look like very pale. Oh. It's, you're okay, right? Of course I am, dear. What's wrong? No, nothing. Don't worry about it. It's I just I got worried all of a sudden. I guess. You, you look. You're all shaken. Just go take a seat, dear. Okay. Yeah, I got some warm snickerdoodles if you'd like some. I... Just... I, I'm... Just one, I guess. Alright, let me get you a cookie. And now, tell, is everything okay, dear? Here you go. Here's Has a anybody come by at all? No, nobody's been here. What? I... I've been hearing bad things around, and I got concerned for you. Oh, well, I'm all right, dear. Nobody comes by here besides, you know, the usual bad boys who don't really want to talk to me. So, I promise you, I'm, I'm all right, and I'll be okay. I thank you for being concerned over me. I'm sorry to answer the door fast. <laughs> it takes it, me a little bit to get out of bed. It's it's fine. I I know it takes you a while. I'm, I'm sorry if I rushed you. Oh, it's all right. I was just worried something bad was happening, or you were getting chased by somebody. No, I'm I'm not. I I can I can run away pretty fast. I know, but you know if you ever are in danger, it's okay to come over here. I I, I can't really do much, but I, I you're safe here all the time with me, okay? I know, Betty. I uh tomorrow I I gotta do a job thing, so I don't know if I'll be around much. Oh, well, I'm happy you're getting the job and you're doing something. You know, I'm very proud of you, right? I know, Betty. Thank you. Of course. You sure you're all right? Yeah. I'm gonna right. stay here for now, okay? Great, good. Do you want me to make you something to eat? I mean, I'm just fine with a snickerdoodle, if I'm being honest. That's very fair. Man, I should get a TV in here, shouldn't I? I don't. Well, I mean, you mainly oh, read books anyways. I mean, I read them, but I don't 
do it. I mean, I've read pretty much all of them. If I've had these my entire life. Lap living in this house, so yeah, just rereading old books. I don't really think there's much space to put a TV, anyways. If I'm being honest, it's very fair. I mean, we did go. We used to live in the nice big house. We just stayed here when we, you know, the kids all moved out. I know. You want the? What you want a blanket or something? I, I'll, I'll, I'm fine. I'll just... You can do you right now. I'll just get comfy, really. Right. Well, I was gonna knit, so... I'll get my knitting needles and I can just sit with you and we can just enjoy the silence together. Okay. Or if you want, we can have a nice conversation. Okay. She is in danger. 